I just came from uh, Ted Strickland, where he had an event over at the Democratic Party, um, where he talked about what Democrats are doing on women's health care and, and on this uh, Roe versus Wade anniversary. Uh, you may face him this fall. Tell me uh, a little <laughs> bit about you, how you differ. Well, as I talked about in my speech today, uh, women's health is incredibly important, and in the legislation that funded Planned Parenthood for federal funding, we also provided funding for community health centers that are open to all women. And uh, they do accept women who cannot pay. They accept women who are in need. Uh, there are about 10 times more of these community health centers in Ohio than there are Planned Parenthood clinics that provide that same health care. So it is an opportunity for us to make the point that this is not about women's health. In fact, we strongly support women's health, at least I do, and others who voted for the legislation. So I thought it was important to make that point this morning. Ted, I think Ted Strickland called you the anti-choice senator, essentially. Is that? I, as I said today, I prefer the way the father, uh, Father Franks talked about it, which is that it's, it's, it's being pro-life. And the sanctity of life is something that young people, particularly, are starting to move toward. It was interesting, uh, you know, to talk to some young people this week who are in town for the march and uh, from all sorts of colleges and universities in Ohio. And the polling indicates that among younger people, there is a movement uh, toward the pro-life position. Younger people tend to be more pro-life, they say, than um, people who are middle-aged and, and, and even older Americans. So it's interesting. I think more people are looking at the science, understanding um, the fact that uh, you know, life, uh, I mentioned the neonatal units. Uh, I was at uh, Rainbow Children's uh, this week, earlier this week, looking at these babies that could fit in the palm of your hand uh, who are able to be saved. And, and uh, I think people look at their sonograms now and you know they just know much more about the the fact that although in the womb it is life. Okay, just to dispatch real, real quickly, we're right on time. Sorry, guys. Um, I think that covered most of my questions. Okay, uh, okay one more can, question. Can I, can I ask? Yeah, uh, sure. uh, we were talking to 